Alyssa and I were in the store uh, on Sunday afternoon. We had an event going on. Mark Shriver was there uh, talking about his new biography uh, of the Pope. Uh, and all of a sudden, we saw and heard police converging uh, on the block, closing off the block, um, motioning everybody to get off the sidewalks and, and, and inside. So we had to lock down the store. And so, Lissa, before all of that hell broke loose on Sunday, were you aware of this conspiracy theory that was somehow implicating the pizzeria and the businesses around it? Yeah, we had become aware of it in the weeks uh, the weeks before then, in kind of fits and starts, really. And we knew from the owner of, of Comet that he had been receiving weird things on his social media. And then we ended up consulting with other businesses on the block. And it turned out we all, over the weeks uh, of November, started to receive phone calls, things on social media, uh, complete fantastical assertions about all of our businesses that attempted to connect all of our businesses, again, totally preposterous ways. And were you nervous? I mean, when you started, I don't know what sorts of things you saw on social media. Maybe you can share those. But were they? threatening and sort of dark enough that you started to worry about what might happen? Oh, most definitely. They, they, they were quite, quite threatening, including uh, th uh, threats of, of death. And these were, these were reported to the authorities. And we were bracing for, for something like what, what, what ultimately happened on Sunday. 